Hey gorgeous, welcome to a massive unboxing of Ipsy Glam Bag and Glam Bag Plus. This has been a while, I haven't recorded in a hard bit, so I'm sorry, and um, let's just get to it because we have a lot to go through. So the first one I have over here is actually a Glam Bag, and I don't remember where this one is from. I think this was my last one for September. No, so I think this is October. This is the last one for October. So we have October right over here for my glam bag and something else missing here. Okay, so let's put this over here. The next one we have is I believe October Glam Bag Plus. Yep, here we go. And the other one should be September. There we go. So here we got September. Let's go ahead and try September 2021 Glam Back Plus. And this one has a beautiful packaging uh, for back to school. Not necessarily my love to. And I really don't enjoy these drawstrings. I hate them, but let's just not dwell on the thought of it. I just hate them. The car that they offer is supposed to be a theme of back to school. And this is work, school, life. And it tells you steps of how to take care of your skin. The steps should be cleansing, toning, add serum, eye cream, moisturizer, and protect your skin with SPF 30 plus. Yes, always 30 plus and really, really good. This is like the one thing you need to be doing is sunscreen every single morning. All right, so first item, it's the brush cleanser from Sophia plus Mabel. I did receive one from this Bay Box from their brand and it was actually really cute. And I guess they're like a very new brand or something. And I just got this one. My point is like a little scrubber for your brushes. To, in I don't know. It was really cute. It was it was not a lot of points, and it was just really cute, which I love to try it out. The next item is Vegan by Happy Skin, and this is the original skin essence toner lotion. And this is natural ingredients, cruelty free, and a vegan product. This is what it looks like. It has like that little pink transparent or translucent color really really cute and definitely something i need because i do need a cleanser but this is more like an essence toner so either or you can do a toner and an essence afterwards but if you can do either or as well so i'm going to be doing this one once i run out next item is a pure brazilian with carotene acai argan oil and cocoa butter this pure brazilian works wonders in my damaged hair i've tried multiple products from them and it was amazing so i used my points to get this one and i do not regret it this is a daily anti-free serum and it's a leave-in treatment for stronger healthy looking hair definitely a recommendation for me if you've been getting your eye on it it is so so good the next one is canalogica this is a hydration product and is a facial hydration oil this is what the packaging looks like i love the chrome in it and i believe this was uh something that was chosen for me i don't think i chose this myself this is what it looks like very cool uh i don't think i need the oil right now so this is probably gonna be on the next giveaway which is coming soon so make sure you guys stay tuned the next item is 111 skin and this is the hydraulic acid aqua booster i absolutely love 11 skin i love their packaging their products are super expensive about 100 dollars each but they are so good, so worth it, and definitely makes changes in my skin, at least for me. This is what the bottle looks like, and I'm definitely going to be getting on these very soon for fall. Because again, hydration is key for this weather. Next item is Dragon Beauty, and this is one of her lippies. I haven't really tried anything from her brand, but this is in the color Nikita. And their packaging is really cute. I do love this type of crystal, and the color itself, I don't know. Would it work on me? Maybe. We'll see. It seems similar to the one I'm wearing right now. So this might be a hit. Maybe not. Otherwise, it will be on the next giveaway. Uh, I probably won't open it because I do have a lot of lippies already working with at this time. And the last but not least, and this I believe was my selection. Or maybe they selected for me. But I was very excited. And this is from Sunday Riley. This is a Good Jeans by Sunday Riley. I absolutely love Sunday Riley. It really helped me out when I was dealing with my acne. And this is a lactic and licorice root. And it's all in one lactic acid treatment. This stuff, it's amazing. And it looks really, really good. I absolutely love it. This is like the second product I have received by Sunday Riley on Ipsy. And I absolutely love it. They are so amazing. And definitely one of those products that you have to try it out they usually smell really bad because they're very natural 
but they have worked wonders. So definitely a huge recommendation for me. Actually, I think even though I didn't love the drawstring, I think this has been one of the best Ipsy Plus I've had in a long time. Just because the sun dry leaf, just because of the essence, which I really needed. And the one one skin, absolutely, this is my most favorite. And the Dragon Beauty is a really nice addition. It's a new brand. Um, Nikita is pretty famous. So it's, it's good to see what they got going on and to try out her shades. So I'm excited to try it out and see how it goes. Next one is the September Beanie Glam Bag. And I almost forgot I had these. So I had to run and go get it. But let's go ahead and get rid of this part. This is what the bag looks like. It's actually really cute. It is back to school. Um mixed feelings about it not really my color but i think it has like this mean girls vibe that they used to have these type of colors all the time and the packaging is really nice it does feel nice this material not so much not my type of material but the leather looks pretty cool and i do love the gold uh ipc right in the middle all right so this one does have a car and again back to school he's gonna tell us the prices of the items that we got first item is the pure list red and glow illuminating bb cream and this is a spf 30 this is what it looks like let me see if it will focus there we go this is what it looks like i actually have the bb cream perfect glow cream spf 30 so i have the same one but this is just perfect glow this is actually radiant glow and it's pink the only problem is that last time i tried this my skin was not great but my skin was breaking out every time I used this and somebody else told me the same actually Jackie Naturals make sure you follow her she also tried it and she told me that she did have a little bit of breakouts and she thought it was maybe this too so I don't know if I want to risk it I don't want to break out my skin has been amazing lately so we'll see if I'll add it to the giveaway or I'll try it out I don't know I'll have to think about it a little bit but that one is in a full size $35 worth the next one it's a beautiful mini brush this is what it looks like in white I love it this is from SL, SL Miss Glam, and this is a Marble Eye Blender M15. This is worth $19, $19, Jesus. So $19 for this little fella, and it has like little Vs, like right over there. I don't know if you can see it. Very cute. Uh, I don't know if it's $19 worth, so it better be magic with that price. The next one is actual Less Beauty City Chic Eyeshadow Quad, and this is a value of $19 and this is a full size technically um this this is what the packaging looks like and right when you open it up is it a quad or it's just one? Oh, it is a quad this is so cute though this is really cute for being a small little quad it has beautiful shades so there you go very very good for smoky and natural look um this is amazing for traveling too what do you guys think should it be on the giveaway or should i give it a try I really like it. It's really cool. And, and the colors seem to be very, very um, dark for fall. The only problem is it doesn't have a mirror. But, I mean, they're probably trying to save money. So, that will make sense. Really cool. This is worth $19. Um, I, I think it's worth it, honestly. A little bit expensive. But it's pretty worth it if it's going to have the four little shadows. The next one is from Tatcha. And this is the Rice Wash. This is $35 worth in a full size. And I tried some of the products, amazing, very expensive, but so amazing. This is what it looks like, beautiful packaging. Uh, this is probably going to be the type of color, if I ever get my own brand, this is probably going to be the type of color I go for. But really, really cool, and I'm definitely going to give it a try. I need to see how good they are. The next and last for this box is a full-size $4 pore mask, and this is the BRTC Vitamin B5 Velvet and Vitamin A Velvet Mask Duo. This is what it looks like. It's two shade masks. I think I selected... No, I don't think so. I actually selected the Rice Tatcha. So this was actually added and I absolutely love it. This is probably the best glam bag I've had in a very long time. Known brands, cute little additions to it, extra practical items in it, and a little bit of everything. And the shade mask is always a good addition. I, I'm very excited about this. I, th I think this is the coolest bags I've had. So September 2021, Eve Glam and Glam Bag Plus killed it for me this is like the best i have had in a very long time and i haven't been excited about ipsy for a while now it's, it's been pretty disappointing so kudos ipsy like you finally did it for me so let's go ahead and see now how october did and if i remember well because it's fresher in my mind october didn't do so good since we just did ipsy glam bag for september let's do october and that way we can compare one and one packaging super cute beautiful for halloween i definitely love the lippy vampire um maybe a tiny bit stylish but i'm all for it and if you see even the zipper it has ipsy and it's like a little green lipstick 
This is really cool. This is really cool. I do love that part. All right, so for this one, there was one that was outside. Let me get the card first. The theme is Pretty Wicked. This is what it looks like. Pretty Wicked. That's that's right. And the first item is Murat Retinol Juice Renewal Night Cream. This is what it looks like. And this is a deluxe sample. It's actually worth $82 in a full size. And let's go ahead and see how big the actual packaging is. So, of course, this big box for this tiny little sample. I don't get it why they do this. I'm going to give it a try, but that was, that was very tiny. That was whole packaging at its best. All right, next item is going to be from Reeler. This is what it looks like. It's a power wear blush and not your average. This is a pretty nice packaging. I do love that little glow to the gold and the shade itself it's pretty cute very nice and it has a mirror with it so really really good i think this is actually gonna be a keeper for me just to have it for traveling or when i have to be on the go that's a really good size blush and it does have a mirror which is really cool the realer is a known brand too and this is worth 20 dollars as a full size this is technically a deluxe sample but it's pretty decent that's a pretty decent travel size the next item is this works cleansing pads and this is in transit no traces this is the packaging i believe they're inside and this is a deluxe sample usually worth 27 dollars for a full size this is cleansing pads to make it easy to remove makeup excess oil build they are biodegradable and they are made with natural ingredients too so that's pretty cool nourishing your skin and it has rose water and sweet almond oil this works is a pretty known brand it has really cool formula so i'm excited to see what this will do for my skin next item is pump plump skin next item is plump skin and this is a retinol eye cream and this is by tony moly this is what it says it's literally plump king doing from pumpkin really really funny they always do it in the place and words and it's a deluxe sample this is worth 25 dollars in a regular size Next item is Sugar Cosmetics Plush Crush Cream Crayon in Bourbon Brie. This color is actually really nice. I do have a, a dress that looks just like that color. It is sort of a warm orangey brown and it's worth $15.99. This is considered a full size and it has hydraulic acid and vitamin E. They do have really good lippies and I'm actually excited for this. This is a pretty decent color. That is all for the October one. I think it's such a really cool and it's value over 50 plus. So I definitely think the value is here. I think this is a really good box. Um, I just think that sometimes they're actually doing better than the plus if you ask me. But let's see how October did compare to them and compare to the one from last month. All right, so here we are, October 21 and <laughs> This is a mixed feelings over here. I remember choosing and seeing what we had available and it was not a good selection at all. I really was not excited about this box. So hopefully I'm not too negative. I'm sorry if this is a trigger for you. Just keep on going. But the packaging came kind of busted as you can tell. But they also brought Murad which is a good brand. And you know I always enjoy to try it out when I need my skincare. So this is a skin smoothing polish and this is an exfoliator cleanser type of deal. Yeah, I think this is like a cleanser exfoliator. Let me see the packaging itself. Skin smoothing polish. It says cleanser, but this is definitely a type of exfoliator. It's a glossy type of box, really cool. And I'm definitely gonna add this probably to the next giveaway because I already have a couple exfoliators. And I don't know, I sometimes I like Mira, sometimes it doesn't work as great in my skin. So I prefer to give it to someone else that might enjoy it. The next item is Gold Fade In MD, and this is a Solution Mist Daily Nutrient Facial Mist. This is what it looks like. Uh, I think it's a mist, but you can probably use it as a toner as well. It's to quench and dull and dehydrated complexion, and it has a ultra fine mist. So really cool, definitely a addition that I will be enjoying once I have to try new essence. The next item is Dermalac, and this is a this is a weird name. So Dermalac Cosme Cosmeceuticals, Cosmeceuticals. And this is self-esteem beauty sleep serum this is what the packaging looks like i've seen them on allure before for their serum and i think this might be it yep so this is the serum that we've seen everywhere in allure i'm very excited to try it out and i've heard good things about it if you tried it before please let me know down below i would love to hear it the next item is beautiful brushes that i found and i just had to select something and i went for it and this is from lovecraft and beauty 
I've had their uh, foundation, no, I had their bronzer set before, but just closer. This is what their packaging is looking like. If you enjoy that, let me know. This is probably gonna be in the next giveaway because I have way too many brushes. They do feel very, very soft. So this will be a pretty cool addition. And it has four for your eye and one, I believe, to do your line. So very nice for you to have. Next and last item is Rowan. And this is Cake Lash on Black Noir. I believe this is a, what is this, a mascara? Yeah, so this is Rowan Mascara, and this is really cool packaging. It's actually reflecting on the light, but it's very chromatic, as you can tell right there. And the one itself is probably going to be curling because it's very thin on the front, but this is what it looks like. Really cool. Uh, it's a little bit heavy. It does remind me a little bit of Thry Cosmetics. I just hope it's as good as them. I don't think this is waterproof, but... It is worth to give it a try. I definitely need to start new mascara. So here we go. We'll have to try it out. Give you guys a review. If you want to hear about it, let me know down below. That is all for today. This was a lot that we have gone through. So thank you so much for sticking around. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below what's your favorite. Do you think Ipsy is even worth it anymore? I mean, September really killed it. October, I'm not so sure. It's not necessarily any products that I was super excited about or really waiting for. And I honestly, I've been thinking of just canceling it all along because even Glam Bag X, it's not really been worth it this past couple months and I'm really not excited as much anymore and I think I'm wasting my money I mean I do use it for giveaways but I'm not really seeing it using on me like I'm not seeing that I'm getting anything back from my money I think I'm just spending money for giveaways pretty much that is all for today if you guys enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up subscribe and let me below your thoughts I would love to hear it and I'll see you guys next time bye